1. Ensure your PC is powered on and connect the scanner to it following the correct connection order. 2. Remove the calibration board from the carrying case. 3. To access the calibration program, click on the Scanner Calibration button, located in the lower left corner of the software's home screen. Next, scan the QR code on the back of the calibration board with the scanner to import its accuracy information. 3. Before calibration, carefully read the on-screen instructions. Place the calibration board horizontally, click Start Practice, and calibrate the scanner at the specified height. After finishing the practice, click Start Calibration to perform an accuracy check. Keep the scanner in a horizontal position and verify its accuracy at a height of 30 cm. If the accuracy test is passed, click Finish to return to the home page or continue the calibration. You can recheck the accuracy or calibrate the scanner if the test fails. Follow the on-screen instructions to calibrate the scanner in five directions, horizontal, left, right, front, and back. First, calibrate the scanner horizontally at seven different heights. The top, left, and right bars indicate the depth camera's tilt, pitch, and height, respectively. Hold the scanner and move it following the on-screen prompts until the slider is in the designated area and changes from white to green. Aim the scanner at the center of the calibration board until the cross stays green for a few seconds. Second, perform the left calibration at three different heights. Aim the scanner at the central cross and tilt it to the left by 20 degrees. Then, move the scanner following the instructions until both the sliders and the cross remain green for several seconds. Similarly, check the on-screen prompts and follow the instructions to calibrate the right, front, and back sides. After finishing the calibration, the software will indicate whether it was successful. If it was, click Save Results to complete the calibration. Then, click Complete to return to the home page and wait for the cameras to reboot automatically. If it was not successful, recalibration is required. 1. Avoid scratching the calibration board, as it will impact calibration accuracy. 2. Keep your hand as stable as possible when performing the calibration. Finally, calibration can be somewhat challenging for beginners, so feel free to contact our customer service for one-on-one -on -one guidance if needed.